Hill, ladies and gentlemen. Dr. John. And his beautiful, gifted, and charming wife, Joe. Dr. John Hill. Andrew. See you later. Pa! People are important to the doctor as long as he can use them to get what he wants. And honey, what he wants, he gets. Are you be asleep? I've been waiting for you. Have a recital next week. Don't you practice tomorrow? Am I boring you? I like being kissed. But? Oh, I'm interrupting. I'm always interrupting. Maybe I should call your office and make an appointment. I thought you were on the way to the horse show. I had to talk to you. What's wrong? Everything. What the hell am I doing? Why am I going off to a horse show when things are the way they are between John and me? I love you. Let's not go back to Houston tonight. Let's just get in the car and head west. John. And wind up in... San Antonio or El Paso. Be shangri la Yeah, I feel like this is the first day of my life. Nothing's changed. Nothing's gonna change. This is between me and Joan. We're talking money, doctor. My money. The money that changed you from a greenhorn cut boy to a big city know-it-all. The money that put you in that big house. I'm gonna make you smile. Okay? I'm gonna cut down on the horse shows. I'm gonna stop smoking cigarettes. I'm gonna learn a lot more about your music. <laughs> what do I do? You just be here. Raising your own penicillin? Trying to find the source of an epidermal rash. Can John help you? He gave me a shot. I just feel like upsing all the time. Why don't you take your pills? Will you go to the hospital? What's happening? The pressure's down, so they put her on IV to build up the blood volume. Get away from us. Kill her! I want the coroner out to that funeral home today, before they close that coffin. Do you, Anne, take this man, John, to love and to cherish? To honor and obey for as long as you both shall live. I do. <laughs> <laughs>